reported, but an awful lot of damage. Mike Seidel live in Sublette, Illinois this morning. Mike, the National Weather Service will be out later this morning, but there is substantial damage to report. Here we go. Good morning, Sam, from Woodhaven Lakes Resort. This is the largest privately owned campground uh, in the country, over 7,000 lots, and a lot of those have been destroyed. Uh, there are trees down everywhere, so there may have been a tornado, but there's certainly some kind of a, a wind coming down, a downburst or a microburst, because there are stands of trees as far as the eye can see. But look at the damage out here. Many of these uh, trailer homes, some of these mobile homes, uh, some of these Winnebago-type uh, vehicles have been smashed. Over here, we've got one that's completely destroyed. Let's walk down the road here and we'll uh, show you what's going on as far as the damage. I mean, you, there's nothing worth saving. Look at this camper over here that's been flipped up. One over here to my right is uh, completely destroyed in pieces. The winds have blown out the windows across the way here. Across the road, we've got this one that's flipped over and is smashed to the ground, so the entire body of this uh, vehicle is gone. There's the bottom, the base, and you can kind of see the uh, bathtub in there. And then in the distance, another um, a facility, another home, somebody's uh, summer home out here. This is basically a summer place is gone. And look at the trees down everywhere, another flip home. And this is what we see across this community. Uh, fortunately, no one was killed, no one was seriously injured as far as we know. But everybody uh, this morning is out picking up the pieces. And we talked to one resident, and she gave us her story and what she did as soon as she found out this storm was on the way. Our house and waited. Within three to five minutes, we had 40 people running here, parking along the way. When we got out, about 10 minutes later, we looked. There were trees down on both sides of us, and behind us, it's clearly devastated. There were 40 alone in the women's side of that bathroom. It's a, a stone structure and also a number of folks on the men's side, and that's where they went. They uh, have their own siren here in Woodhaven, and uh, that's what sent them to safety. Again, Sam, a real mess out here. It's going to be a long cleanup process. They have gotten the roads open, as far as I can see, by uh, working all night, cutting down these trees. But uh, it's just like, uh, just like a war zone. But look at the skyline. All the trees yeah. have been down across the entire area, at least in this section of this uh, residential uh, park. All right. Sam? Mike Seidel, excellent work, Mike, on getting those images out in a very difficult situation. In our string of firsts that we all brought or had together right here on AMHQ this morning, Mike Seidel giving you the first images out of Sublette, Illinois.